Welcome to episode three of the apartment series, Bathroom Edition. of the apartment series you know these videos take me a while to film <laughs> and a while to edit but you know it's fine anyway this is my first day attempting to decorate my bathroom i got these like organizers from amazon i think they were twenty dollars i'll link them down below and i really just wanted to tackle my bathroom drawers because it's absolutely absolutely a mess seriously these bathroom drawers may just be the reason why i am absolutely late for literally everything <laughs> so my goal for today is to just organize them with those containers that i got they're pretty cute and like just a little plasticky several of these little things i have about 20 of them and i think it should be enough i ordered two so i have like 40 in total and if i have too many then i'll just use them and like my dash door in my bedroom for when we decorate my bedroom. But anyway, I'm hungry. My tea is boiling. Guys, I'm low-key kind of annoyed with myself because I literally ran out of like toilet paper, milk, dishwashing liquid, hand soap, like literally I'm on my last of everything. Garbage bags. Like, I still have black tea with a little caffeine in it to make some coffee or some, <laughs> some tea. So I'm gonna have some tea and then we're gonna get started on the bathroom. to remind myself that this is not a New York City apartment vlog and that you guys are just here for the apartment stuff so I think the best way to start this because I am dreading going into my bathroom and looking at those drawers like they are they're not it I think the best way to start is to just unbox and unwrap all of the little containers and then to put the little grippy stickers on all of them these are actually really cute and like they're 3M and I think they're the same company that makes like command strips so I'm sure they'll work really well. getting all the little stickies on each and every one of these good news is there are extra so if you mess up don't fret you'll have about maybe 20 or so extra to play with now it is time to get into this bathroom and look at these drawers girl they are they're bad my bathroom doesn't have any natural light so please forgive me the lighting is kind of weird in here and i'm quite literally sitting on my toilet while i'm talking to you yeah, it's um, it's not looking cute over here. Oh God. Like this is why I'm late because I'm trying to find a lipstick. I can't find it. And then I'm like, okay, do I want to just change my whole entire makeup look? And then it's like, it's just, it, bro, I, I forgot I even bought this. Okay. Okay. The first step is to acknowledge that you have a problem. So in the grand scheme of things for this bathroom, I'm probably going to put art or shelves here and then our shelves over there. For right now, I think we just need to focus on cleaning up these drawers because honestly, I don't want to decorate the outside of my bathroom if the inside's not 
up to par. You know what I mean? It's from the inside out. jigsaw puzzle I don't really have too much of an actual plan this is actually so perfect like you would think that this was made for this store in particular I do now have to get all of my junk <laughs> in here and there's some things that I don't think are gonna fit in these containers like my hair straightener my blow dryer my hair curler stuff like that so I'll probably have to reorganize it a bit but I do think this is really good I'm really happy I got two because I still have Another door to do. So I think there's some stuff that's in the top drawer that should probably go in this drawer and like vice versa. So let's get started on that drawer. I'm going to do the same process, empty the drawer out, then clean it, and then we'll see where we're going from here. a box of trays if I'm going to do the second drawer so let's do that what are you doing okay I don't know if anyone else's cat is like this but my cat is obsessed with q-tips and because the q-tips are out he's in here and he needs to get out jock come on we're not doing this today <laughs> he does not want to leave me alone today so now I'm going to open up the second box and I realized I never showed you guys how many of each sizes you get, etc. whatever. So you get like four of these ones and they're the big wide ones. Don't know how many this is, but these are the big long ones. Then you get these shorter ones, quite a good amount, and then all of these little tiny ones. I kind of like these the most because you can just like throw stuff in them. I don't know. All right, let's go organize that second drawer. Stuff, it's just 
the boxes are actually going to be better for my makeup just because everything is just so like teeny tiny, you know what I mean? So... Oh my god, I think I finished y'all. I am like, I'm so happy, I'm so proud. It looks so good and it literally looks like I have less stuff than what I do or I have less than what I started with because it's just more organized. Granted, there was a lot of empty products, a lot of boxes, a lot of packaging, a lot of stuff I literally just had to throw out, but I'm really excited with how it looks. I'm gonna play with it over the next couple of days before I end the video just to see if I like it, see if I move anything. I actually <laughs> realized I had this bar of soap that my friend's grandma made for me in Greece, so I'm gonna just put that in the shower. So I actually use that because I literally have had it since last summer and I never used it. So now this is in the shower, hopefully I'll use it more. I have just a lot of stuff out right now. A lot of it's empty products, a lot of it I think it's trash. So pray with me as I try to clean up my bathroom. But for the next episode, I wanted to tackle my kitchen and I got these jars for my kitchen. But I'm thinking I'm actually going to put some cotton balls in this instead. I want to hang some shelves in here eventually, so I'll probably just put these on the shelf. But right now there are no shelves, so I'll probably just put it on my countertop. But I think it would be really cute to have little cotton balls in here. And then I'm going to do the same thing with a smaller jar for the Q-tips. my loves <laughs> it's present day me i'm editing the bathroom video now and i realize i talk entirely too much so the bathroom video is going to be part two or two parts <laughs> so watch out for the next part where you'll get to see me finish the bathroom and i did get shelved so a little sneak peek there i wanted to show you guys exactly how i ended everything in the drawer so this is what it looks like now I used to have the makeup erasers there but I moved my face styles there because I thought it made more sense to have all of my like stuff here and then to keep all of my makeup stuff up here so it's literally been a few weeks since you guys originally seen me kind of clean out the drawers and I'm really happy to say that it's still looking pretty organized so I love you so much. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video and make sure you stay tuned to see me hang up this and I'm actually probably going to hang up something today too behind me. So I love you. Subscribe and I'll see you next time.